Welcome to our tech troubleshooting session. Today, we're addressing a question that many developers encounter when working with Kubernetes. Our viewer has installed Minikube locally and set up Jenkins using Helm. However, they're facing a frustrating issue. The Jenkins service is stuck in a pending state. Let's dive into the details and uncover why this is happening and how to resolve it. All right, guys, welcome back to another tech video. Today, we're gonna to be going through your question, answering it, and hopefully finding that solution for you. Now, don't forget to stay just a little bit crazy like me, and hopefully you'll get to that resolution. Anyway, on to the video, cheers. If your Jenkins service is stuck in a pending state on Minikube, the first thing to check is the type of service you are using. By default, Jenkins is installed with a load balancer service type which may not work properly in a Minikube environment. To resolve this issue, you can change the service type to node port. This allows you to access Jenkins through a port on your Minikube node. After editing the service, you can find the node port assigned to Jenkins by running the command to get services again. Look for the port under the port S column. Once you have the node port, you can access Jenkins using the Minikube IP and the assigned node port. Use the command Minikube IP to get the IP address. Finally, open your web browser and navigate to the Jenkins URL using the Minikube IP and the node port. This should allow you to access the Jenkins dashboard successfully. Let's now look at a user-suggested answer. If you're having trouble with Jenkins service pending on Minikube, there's a quick command you can use. Just run this single line to install Jenkins without needing a separate config file. If you want to set multiple options at once, you can do that too. Just separate each option with a comma. For more configuration options, check out the available settings online. It's a user-friendly way to see what's possible. And that's it, guys. I hope that's found the answer that you were looking for and you got through to that solution. If you did, please hit the subscribe button. I'd really appreciate it. And until the next time you have a technical issue, I'll see you. Have a good one.